Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. This will go from January 21st through the 25th, 2020. That's where we are in 2020. We'll look at some of mm. You know, when your lips are big, you have to reapply, baby. Okay. Okay. And action. Okay. Gemini. Okay, so for this week, I've already pulled two cards for love and romance, career, and finance, all right? So, Gemini, let's get to it, okay? Thank you for every, to everyone that subscribes, likes, shares, comments, all that stuff. It means a lot. It keeps the channel continuously going. Please like the video. Go ahead and like it right now. All right, all right. Okay, all right. So, love and romance for Gemini. Ooh. My God. <laughs> oh, gosh. I mean, come on. Seven of Swords and Queen of Swords. At the bottom of the deck, Princess of Swords. So, somebody's spying. Somebody's trying to get away with something. Someone is not exactly speaking how they feel, what they think. Someone's on guard. Someone's trying to be objective in this situation, trying to listen to what the person is saying. But at the same time, you could be dealing with the cancer person. Uh, you could be dealing with another uh, air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Someone's trying to get the upper hand or keep control of a situation by hiding, being deceptive, moving about, not exactly saying how they feel. The communication between you and another person is very short, it's very cutting, it's very to the point, you're very frank. It's, um, this is just hard. Well, y'all the only sign I gotta pull another card on. Oh my gosh. Why is the Seven of Swords and the Queen of Swords here for love? This is just, so some of you guys are married, you're in some relationship, or this could be business. So this looks like a marriage or a relationship there's someone spying there's someone hiding something this could be you gemini right um someone's trying to have the strength to either walk away or to stay something about sex and intimacy here other parties are here. Yep. Okay. Someone wants forgiveness. Either you, Gemini, or someone else you're dealing with. But someone is uh, trying to make... Or so, Gemini may be saying, I'm trying to make permanent changes toward being the person that you need me to be. Or someone is saying this about you. Or saying it to you. Could be dealing with a Leo, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Pisces, and Cancer. Could be dealing with a Virgo. You know that someone is hiding something. And you're trying to have enough strength to either stay and forgive or to leave. You may have a new person here. The other person may have a new person Somebody's trying to make permanent changes here because the relationship is going sour. Someone's being very deceptive. It could be you, Gemini. It could be the other person. This is you, Gemini. Sorry. Oh, Lord. It just, it just gets worse in the tower at the bottom of the deck. It looks like whatever problems were here or are here, they have been problems you guys have been dealing with from the beginning of the relationship. But it just kept getting swept under the rug. Nobody was really getting to the root of the issue. And now the universe, which is the tower, it's a major arcana, is saying that uh, problems, a challenge is arising in a relationship. Um... These problems have historical reference. So it's like these problems are 
have always been with the relationship from the you know the start of the the relationship is history here with these same issues and if you guys don't deal with them or really deal with them break that you could be dealing with the Scorpio too. break down uh, this this tower I'm here this ivory tower that you guys have built it's built on false and faulty shaky ground you have to deal with the root of the problem and not the branches and not the leaves and you guys have been dealing with this issue for a while I'm, I'm seeing other people that could be the issue okay hopefully career finance looks a lot better temperance Taurus got temperance in career finance four of cups So you're trying to find like have like a work life balance here you may feel like you're doing one of or the other too much too much work some of you are working at home you're working at the place and then you go home and you work some of you have two ways of earning income here um some of you are just really trying to have a change here or make some change some significant change either in the workplace or for you going to another work setting some of you are just trying to keep the peace within a, a dynamic at work hmm. Something that you do on a side, like a, a side job, is going to bring you a lot of prestige or money. Some of you have, you are going to have like a wealthy marriage. Or you, or you want to marry someone that's going to increase, of course, your financial status. Or you di you're dating someone who is wealthy and you want to marry them you want to move in with them or you want them to move in with you it says that things that you have been working hard for are coming to fruition stick with it uh, you may find a bit of uh, See the possibilities here because you may be getting stuck in I just keep doing I just keep trying I just keep trying to make this turn over and manifest be better for me but it says here you're gonna create that stability with that fourth cup just keep going let's see what the advice is for you trust yeah in regards to career and finance please do trust um, trust that this will turn over for you. This is very good for you. Love and romance. Good luck. If you if you are in a turbulent situation, get out of it. Some of you are feeling stuck or tired. You can't. You haven't planned for departure. This is like a relationship where it's kind of one-sided. It may even be a bit of like devil energy where it's codependent um, in different aspects. It could be money. It could be um, emotional. It could be anything. But definitely some of you, you uh, haven't planned for what would, what could happen. So now you're feeling stuck. Some of you have taken on another person's children. Some of you know that you're in your marriage. Your person is hiding something from you. Maybe another child. Maybe another person. You know that they're having sex with a new person or someone else. You're spying. You're trying to find out the truth. Or vice versa. Someone's doing this to you, Gemini. These problems, once again, have had have historical reference it's always been there it may have calmed down at one point but it never went away 
Gemini, uh, good luck. And if you feel like this reading resonated with you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Um, or take advantage of the $5 one question or more than one question text question. You can text the number below, um, follow the instructions, pay for your question, receive the answer to your question via text message on your mobile device. Um, Gemini, have a really good week. Remember to stay in prayer. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.